Hey guys, welcome back to another video, and today I'm going to show you guys how to upgrade, uh, slash replace the RAM in the, in one of these Dell Optiplex, uh, 7010s. So let's just get straight into it. So putting it on its side, I recommend you put it like this to make it easier. Anyways. Just get straight into it. Stand is pretty bad, if you ask me. So, anyways, what you want to do is just pull on this lever, pull up, then it should come out. There is a bug. It's not bad, it'll kill me, so. <laughs> The RAM is right there. So, what you want to do is just, you know, push down on these clip thingies, and then they come out. If, if all of the slots are filled, just do it for all of them, so you would do it for these ones right here. But, yeah, here's your RAM. And what, once you get your new RAM, you can just uh, put it back in, and if you do have a, uh, if you want to put more sticks in, you just gotta you know put them in. So, if you're only putting two sticks in, I recommend you put them in like this. I I forgot what the thing was called, but I had dual channel. Dual channel if you want that. But yeah. Pretty easy. If you're putting it in the other slots, it's the same thing. So you just put it like this. You know, just move them one row across. This computer actually doesn't post anymore. You know, turn on and show the screen output because there's some thermal paste on the contacts of for the CPU but I am not going to do that now. So upgrading the RAM in one of these is pretty easy and simple. No screwdriver required because thanks to the easily removable front panel. So you can just move this and then So, uh, yeah, pretty simple, uh, easy upgrade. Um, yeah, so got a pretty short one today. Hope to get a slightly longer one tomorrow. Uh, I'm not tomorrow, next week. So, uh, yeah, I think that's it. And also, this hard drive is not mounted correctly. It's supposed to be down there, but unfortunately, I don't have the mounting brackets. This one came from, like, some moving company. So, they removed the hard drive, but never took out the brackets. So, it, this is my janky hard drive mounting solution. You know, it works. It's not the best. So, uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please like and subscribe, and, uh, oh, wait, I'm not done. I forgot to put the panel on. Yeah, don't forget to put the panel on. Just put it on, and you push it down, and you slide it in with the pegs at the bottom, the handles at the top. So, uh, yeah, this, that's it. So, yeah, I... I hope you guys uh, like this video. Uh, wait, I forgot the lines thingy. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, please like and subscribe, and uh, I'll see you guys next time. Bye.